find the uh, Mr. Fadi? Yes, sir. Because first of all, we were gonna learn. We need to be. We need to know what right about the concept. What is an oracle? Oracle. Oracle is a word uh, derived from goddess. I think <laughs> that is what I heard. Kiran. Yeah, it's a it's a Greek goddess. And... Hello, Kiran. Yeah, I know it's an IBM software and it's based on God's rules. Okay, okay, that's right. So, no, I'm asking what is an Oracle? The abbreviation will be there, right? For SAP, it's their system automation programming. Yeah, or abbreviation. Right, yeah, for Oracle, thing will be there, right? Okay, now I'll tell you, therefore I'll share you. Oracle means... Oracle is a Greek term, I think. Yeah, it's a Greek term and Oracle abbreviation is Operage, Technology, Computing, Logical Engine. Okay, it's a Greek word only, and the uh, abbreviation is there for Oracle. Okay. Uh, okay. So, uh, you know, uh, sorry, uh, insisting every time you and this Rajit don't take it otherwise. There are n number of ERPs were there, even though why we were majorly using Oracle as an ERP. So what is an ERP? Hello, Sajid. Immediately picking up from the concepts. ERPs and why we need to in the market a number of ERPs are there, why we are using majorly Oracle as a major ERP and what's the use of and what's the use by using with Oracle and what's the disadvantages with the other ERPs. These things we will cover first of all at the beginning class of Oracle and uh, here in Oracle Finance we will be majorly touching up the Oracle core financial modules like general ledger account payables, account receivables, cash management and fixed assets. Along with this, we will be covering with some of the concepts like uh, e-business taxation or IELTS, Indian localization concept. In these two, any one of these we will cover. If time permits, we can go with high expenses or high procurement. In Oracle Finance, majorly we will be concentrating post financial modules. And uh, in Oracle, uh, I'll briefly tell you about in five modules which of all I want to discuss. In Oracle General Ledger, we'll discuss about so purpose is majorly to manage financial information and about if you come for Oracle tables, the purpose is about to manage suppliers and Oracle receivables. The purpose of it is majorly to manage the customers. Payables is for suppliers and receivables is for customers. And about our cash management concept, which is the, this module takes up the purpose of bank reconciliation and Oracle fixed assets is used for managing the assets concept. So these five modules are the core financial modules in Oracle, along with some other modules that are also there. Because if you if you are very thorough with this, you can go with some other modules also, the modules which are which are how given you right in the beginning of the session, like EBT or IL. EBT is actually EBT was there in the 11, 11 conference because now 12C we are using. Here it will be completely with IL, Indian localization concepts, and uh, expenses on my procurement that we can discuss orally or if you are interested with this and if you time permits and if you have time to learn, you can go with high expenses and net procurement also in Oracle Finance. And here you will be touching up technically only 20% of the technical part, but financially we will be covering up up to 80% of the concepts in Oracle Finance planning part. And uh, Kiran, do you have any questions for me in Oracle Finance or whatever your experience? Any concepts you have to learn mind to take a class, then these five modules I L S type of uh voice is not issue. Hello, sir, I'm not having much knowledge about the finance product. Because these are the core financial modules. If you uh, you could you can if you search in Google or anywhere, you will be getting first of all Oracle Finance means you will be getting these five modules. And that's why I am asking, if you are ready to learn the course, 
particle finance. Sometimes we also discuss. Hello, is it audible? Hello, yeah. Yes, yes, it's clear. Uh, so basically, uh, like uh, I'm interested in uh, the technical architecture and the database servers. That's coming up to that's coming around Oracle Apps technical, right? And the database administration. Into finance, it's majorly concentrates on banking concepts and suppliers, customers, and different transactions, assets, ledgers, legal entities. The concepts will be covered into finance. But uh, I'm not. Uh, having any idea about the ledgers and fixtures and accounting part. Okay, okay, okay. In finance, it will be teaching you. Okay, okay, thanks. Okay, I'll show you and I'll teach you up everything slide by slide and I'll make mm -hmm. you how much I know on uh, finance and make you up that much in Oracle finance. That's not a problem. Okay. I can do it in this. I'm sure. Fine. Okay, thanks. Okay, do you have any questions yeah. like, uh, you, as you said, you, are, you want to go with architecture and all, that's completely comes under Oracle DBA part, but not Oracle Finance part. Yeah. Forms and tools and these core financial modules and expenses, EBTs, IELTS, these comes under finance and technical parts. Only the architecture comes under DBA part. We can learn the both, that's not a problem. Because I'll be I'm working on Oracle DBA and I'll be taking the classes for Oracle Finance and Oracle DBA both. So my interest are learned and I practice and even I'm working for some organizations on Oracle Finance as a freelancer. Yes, sir, do you have any questions for me? No, sir, I don't have any questions. So we have Sakir Kitak Indra Pandana. Or you want to uh, have the session like so or post to them. That will be useful for the faculty events if they took the class. Without knowing students in first, we can't take up the class even. Exactly. Yeah, the class I mean if, if it is interactive then it then it will be good. The interaction should be between the both sides. Exactly. Yes. yes, yes. That's why I'm that's why I'm asking these many times. We are not gonna teach you. Yeah, we are gonna go practice. We are gonna share knowledge between us. That's my feeling. So Kiran, do you have if you have any questions or if you have any queries, please contact Chandra or Ms. Pandana. We just have a word with oh. them. And you just let oh. me know because as I'm not having any slides or PPTs with me, uh if I give you the, the words or the content orally also it won't make sense. I'll share the PPTs with Pandana and uh, she will guide you. Hello, uh, you know, ma'am. Hello. Yeah, yeah, so it's okay. Hello. Okay, sir, I'll take the PPT from Mandana, ma'am. Yeah, okay, okay. Uh, one more thing, Sadiq and Kiran, uh, whenever we're gonna attend any sessions, don't call anyone, sir, or ma'am. Just call with them. their name, Mr. Arnis. Okay. Sadiq. Thank I'm you. Sure. Thank you very much. Hello. So, 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 Mr. Bankesh, we we're going to meet tomorrow, right? Yeah, sure. Okay. And then I will give you back. Based upon that, we will. Alright. Hello. Alright. Alright. Thank you. Thank you. At what time? At what time? No, no. I mean, I, Spandana, I have, I have confirmed my, uh, I mean, comfortable.